Hey, this is Dr. Macy Payton with Clover Valley Vet, and today I'm going to talk to you about a couple of the common dental abnormalities that we see in horses. First up, rostral points. These are present on that first cheek tooth, the second premolar is what that tooth is called. We treat those by dropping them down with motorized dental machinery or floating, hand floating, smooth out those margins so that the horse is more comfortable. Another thing that we'll see commonly in older horses, especially in geldings, is excessive amounts of calculus and tartar buildup on the canine teeth. These can cause gingival recession and significant gingivitis leading to tooth decay. And you can see in this tooth it's um, actually mobile in the socket. First thing we do is remove um, that tartar and calculus. You can see it's quite a bit of buildup on there. Um, just kind of fracture off that calculus um, manually. Once we have that calculus removed, and this horse is under sedation while we're doing this procedure, they've received pain medications and sedation, then we can assess how much recession and uh, dental decay is present. Occasionally we need to take radiographs to fully assess that tooth. If that tooth is mobile, we will recommend extraction and that's done with local anesthetic blocks and um, manual extraction tools. This procedure can take, you know, up to multiple hours depending on, on how significant that tooth is. And this is the tooth that we ended up removing. And you can see the decay there in the center of the tooth. But that's a very long tooth and it does require quite a bit of time to get that tooth out. Thanks for visiting. Check us out at clovervalleyvet.com.